Hello everyone, it's the time of the year where Lagon is again terrorizing all of us, so here's another guide to let you know how to get through it. So, uh, first of all, you'll want to have your resistances capped, at least cold and physical. This is in the monolith, so I have everything capped. And this one is a little bit different for my first guide. This one is for um, squishy range characters. All you have to do is stand where I'm standing and avoid his moon blast, which is very well telegraphed. And um, phase one should be over pretty fast. As you can see, there's a new mechanic here. You can see the ward on the boss, which uh, it's very, very fun, especially if your character is not optimized. One more thing, you should have your critical avoidance capped also. I don't have it here, so I made it harder for myself. This is a very unoptimized build right here because I didn't get all of the gear I needed, but for a squishy character, you just have to stay kind of on the edge of the stairs there. And the only attack he will hit you with is the Moon Blast. And the tentacles can sometimes hit you. Then, of course, the second phase, the fun phase, as everyone calls it, because everyone knows uh, avoiding his waves and uh, destroying tentacles is a Japanese dream. All you have to do here is uh, be slightly careful with the waves and just run around and destroy the tentacles until the moon that you see in the center goes to full moon then again you will be teleported so this is all that you have to do <laughs> to avoid the waves again critical avoidance helps here because when i got hit i got credit every single time so yeah i did make it a bit harder for myself there you go, uh, the moon is almost full, and now we go back. And now the waves will also go, and this is uh, why I uh, emphasize the critical avoidance, because the wave, it will hit you. It will hit you sometimes, if you're not positioned properly, which I wasn't. Uh, mostly if you stay where I'm staying, you will be okay. You will get some hits, but, you know, your defenses come uh, in handy here. Like, I used uh, my Flame Ward here. Usually I used Flame Ward here whenever he casted his Moon Blast. So when I did avoid it, if I avoided it directly into the wave, I didn't get uh, damaged. And that's all you have to do with Logon. This is actually the easier way than my previous one, which I will link. Uh, just so you know the other way too, because it's still applicable. I don't think they really fixed Lagon. I wish they would. Otherwise, the game is pretty awesome. Uh, the new season is great. The Nemesis mechanic lets you get a lot of uniques very, very early on. And now he'll soon be dead. His Moon Blast is the only thing you really, really need to avoid here. It will one-shot you. Everything else you can tank. And there you go. That's it. That's Lagon version 2 of how to avoid him. Uh, I will be putting out much more Last Epoch and other uh, content now that I'm uh, back in action. So if you like this video, do like, do subscribe, do comment on how you tackled Lagon. Uh, new video is coming out very, very soon on some of the mechanics of the Last Epoch here. Until next time, be good to yourself and others. Goblin out.